Nutrition planning. Okay, if you plan ahead, we can have some healthy choices. We can have foods we enjoy. We can be more consistent and we can make it easy. Easy being the key. If you make it easy, then we can easily repeat it and we can enjoy the foods and know that we are moving towards our goals. Okay, now to start off with, start with, start with a meal. Make sure the meal has some protein, some vegetables, some smart carbs, and some healthy fats. All right, measure all the ingredients in your nutrition tracking app and save the meal. If you like it, save it so you can repeat it. Okay, if, if you wanna save a lot of time and money, what you can do is you can do what's called meal prep. So you can buy in bulk and you can cook uh, in the big pots. You can bake, you can fry, however you do it. You can do a stir fry. I've done stir fries before, meatloaf, um, and I've cooked meals as well. Well, what you do is you cook in bulk and then you portion it out. Okay, so all the ingredients is measured once and then you portion it out. And you can either freeze them for much later or you can put them in the fridge and easily reach for those meals. And you know how much is in each meal. And, uh, and you can easily stay on track that way. But an even, even more easier approach is you can do what's called meal delivery, or you can get the ready to eat meals uh, from the supermarket, the meals that are already pre-made. And all you gotta do is like, this is my muscle share, for example, all you gotta do is just scan the barcode and it throws in all, all the macronutrients in, in your tracker for you. So all you gotta do is just eat. Um, if, you, if you want, you can add a bit more to it. So uh, you can add some extra rice or extra protein or whatever flavor you like and make it more enjoyable. Now, yeah, so those, those are the different ways we can do nutrition planning to make, make it a lot easier. Also have your healthy food shopping list with all your healthy ingredients. You check off the ones that are not in the kitchen. So when you go to the shops, you just do your list first. All right. In your nutrition tracker, you can add in different meals. So you can customize your meals and your meal times. Meal times make it a lot easier. So if you put in the types of meals, the names of the meals, add in the time just before that. What, what that does is helps remind you of when, when you normally eat those, those meals or those snacks. And with that consistency, you train your body to be hungry at a certain time, to eat at a certain time. And with that regular, regularity, you'll find you don't snack as much and you're more likely to hit your nutrition targets and stay within your calories for the day.